Hi, I'm Congressman Jim Himes, and I had the privilege and the honor of serving with John Lewis here in the Congress of the United States. And John was obviously a hero of the civil rights movement. He changed this country dramatically for the better. What I'm going to remember most about John, though, was the way he did it, and the way he did everything. Steeped in faith as he was, he understood something and he lived something that is hard for many of us to understand, the concept of turning the other cheek, of loving your enemy. He was about reconciliation. He reconciled with George Wallace, one of the monsters of segregation and violence in the South that John did so much to, to change. And John had an almost childlike humility about everything that he did. He knew that changing the world was about bringing more people uh, on board, about fighting like mad, fighting really, really hard, but doing it in a way that even your opponent would appreciate for its dignity uh, and its humility. We're gonna miss John and thank you for honoring him tonight. Hello, this is Congresswoman Rosa DeLauro. I was fortunate enough to serve with Congressman John Lewis for 30 years. He was many things to many people, a friend, colleague, mentor, and hero. And yes, he was all those things and so much more. In October 1995, the black clergy in my community asked if I could get Congressman John Lewis of Georgia to come to New Haven, Connecticut for our local elections. I was honored to welcome John to my hometown. Here is what I said that evening. John is a true hero of the cause of progress. It is often said that John Lewis is one of the most courageous persons the civil rights movement ever produced. The most astonishing thing about that sweeping statement is that it probably doesn't go far enough to describe the heroics of the man we honor tonight. John Lewis dedicated a lifetime to protecting human rights and securing personal dignity with unwavering moral character. We should all take a page from John Lewis and get into some good trouble. Stay healthy and stay safe.